welcome to this tutorial. Um, I'm going to be teaching you how to do, the, do that uh, glowing beam effect. <clears throat> like, um, I don't know where you would see it, but um, yeah, it's a pretty cool effect. Okay, so what you're going to need is an image of whatever landscape you want. I'm going to use this grass landscape. I might provide the link in the description. Uh, anyway, alright, you're going to use your paths tool. <clears throat> and you're gonna, um, you have to have a paths tool open. So, um, I'm just gonna close this and tell you how to do it. Okay, so you're gonna go add tab. And you're just gonna click paths. And this dialog will appear. Alright, so you're just going to draw sort of where you want your path to be. Okay, and you can. use these little X mark things just to sort of go with the effect Alright, so that's good. So uh, now what you're going to do is under the pass tool, you're going to click, uh, actually first you have to make a new layer. <clears throat> and then um, you're going to go stroke path. And with solid color, except cancel that, you're going to have to make your foreground whichever color you want. And, uh, sorry, I'm going to do white just because it's very simple. And so you made the new layer, yeah. So you're just gonna click stroke path, and line width can be any color, but um, um, six pixels I think is good, and just click stroke, and there it has a line. All right. So now you're going to um, duplicate this layer three times, and um, you're gonna take the original layer. And you're gonna go filters, and you can just go to another tool. You're gonna go filters, blur, Gaussian blur, and we'll see where you can. And we're gonna blur by five, and click OK, and it's blurring. All right, so it sort of adds a glowing effect. All right, so um, you're gonna take the layer above that, and you're gonna go filters, blur, Gaussian blur, and you're going to blur that by 10. And click OK. And then, um, at the very last time, you're going to, uh, actually you have to duplicate it three times, sorry. And on the last duplicated layer, you're going to go filters, blur, Gaussian blur, and you're going to blur it by 20. And click OK. I'm supporting. Okay. And that is how you get a uh, sort of traveling line effect. And you can uh, merge all those down. Just go Im uh, layer, merge visible, image, merge visible layers. Click merge. Uncheck the eye so that you can see that again. Alright. <coughs> now, um, we're just going to use the uh, fuzzy eraser. Um, zoom in. Uh, sorry. Zoom in. 200. I'm just going to fuzzily use a fuzzy brush to erase this just down a little bit more <coughs> and on the new layer and zoom famish window. There, it looks more natural. Then on here, sorry, probably shouldn't have zoomed in that much. Alright, where's my zoom tool? Alright. Alright, we're just going to erase this just a tiny bit just to blur it around. I think we're just going to make a hole in the ground. How about that? That'll look... Yeah, switch the colors. I think that'll look pretty cool. And then uh, change down the scale.
Alright, view the image to window. Eh, not a good idea. You can experiment with it. I was just trying to show you the basic effect. Alright, <coughs> so that is how you make the glowing effect. So, uh, thanks for watching this tutorial.